The Sanford Pentagon wrapped up an impressive four-week stretch of basketball last weekend. Kettleland's Travis Fossing explains what's next for the Hoops Hotspot. The Sanford Pentagon has hosted 22 Division I basketball games since Thanksgiving week. We're very pleased with the effort. I'm very proud of uh, uh, what we were able to accomplish out here and the, the team really came together and, and pulled off some incredible events under some very unique and difficult circumstances. The final contest featured top-ranked Gonzaga and number three Iowa. Um, anytime you can get that type of a matchup, those level of teams playing each other, uh, creates a lot of excitement. Fans weren't allowed at the game, but Smith strives to bring back more of the nation's top teams. I hope that we can replicate something like that in the future for the fans in this region, um, for our sweet holders, and, and just for, for NCAA basketball in general. The run of marquee matchups is over, but something big is in the works. We're actively engaged in conversation with uh, with several conferences talking about the what-if scenarios or the, or the uh, backup scenarios for conference tournaments to make sure that um, teams are able to get their conference tournaments in and qualify for the NCAA um, tournament. The wish list doesn't end there. We really want to make a concerted effort to put together a really good schedule for 21, and that would include the, the second iteration of the Crossover Classic. The venue's bottom line has taken a hit with the current lack of fans, but Smith says the games will go on. We've certainly felt the impact of, of not being able to have fans, um, not having the, the food and beverage component, um, but, but this, is, this is something we're committed to. This is something that, that Sanford Health is committed to and said this is a, this is a benefit for the community um, and we're, we're going to stand behind it and, and continue to invest to make sure that uh, it's successful. In Sioux Falls, Travis Fossing, Kelloland News. The Pentagon is hosting high school basketball events in late December and early January. The venue may follow the Activities Association's lead on whether to allow fans, but a final decision has yet to be made.